Hello, Michael. Hello, Devin. How are you? Good. Real good. Thank you. I came here for two reasons. To see an old friend and because I need your help. Devin, I'm not the same person anymore. I gave up that life. I guess I'm on my third one now. When we saved your life, it was no random choice, Michael. Right from the beginning, we saw something in you. I still see it. I'm happy out here. Are you? I made a promise a very long time ago, a promise to fulfill one man's dream. Yeah, but I don't Let want me to... finish before you say no. Wilton Knight created the foundation in hopes of finding intelligent solutions to violent problems, problems which have changed little in tens if not hundreds of years. That's what's kept me going, Michael. I truly share the same dream. I wouldn't ask this if there were any other answer. I need you. Come back for the next 30 days until we cement our contract. Then, after that, if you decide to go, I won't say a word. Do you remember what Wilson always said? One man can make a difference. I remember. But that man's not me anymore. Me is fishing. Taking care of my Chevy outside. Me is taking advantage of life for a change, instead of life taking advantage of me. No one ever suggested that what we do is easy. Nothing worthwhile ever is. Don't make me beg, Michael. I have nowhere else to turn. Only under one condition. He'll be waiting for us on arrival. All right, I had to liquidate certain things to make our balance sheet look good. Otherwise, we would have never landed the franchise. Now, frankly, I never considered Kid an asset to begin with. Oh, I see. It's nothing personal, Devin, but the car didn't exactly have fresh oil on the dipstick, if you know what I mean. And with the 4,000 on the way, it hardly seemed worth the price of storage. Yes, hardly. You let this guy actually do this. This guy happens to be your new boss, Mr. Knight. And I'd watch that attitude from now on. I assume you can repurchase the missing components. Most of them, I think. I, mean, I, I was surprised I could sell them at all, but I guess the research facilities found them OK. Shows how up to date they are. Look, if you really insist on buying them back, I just don't bother. No, he's not exactly what you led me to believe he'd be, Devin. Neither are you, Mr. Maddock. How dare you dismantle that car without first discussing it with me? I did what I had to do to keep this operation alive. Now, I make no excuses for it. No, you wouldn't. Humility and modesty are hardly in your makeup. I've had just about all the arrogance I can take. All right, look, you want a nice guy? That's not me, but I get results. As long as I'm the controlling partner, we do things my way. Is that clear? Crusader in a dangerous world, the world of the Knight Rider.